This is the cheapest AI code editor I've seen on the market so far. And besides the code editor, with this subscription also comes the chat with all the possible LLMs on one place, including the video generation which I was really struggling to find. This tool is called Chat LLM Teams, it's made by Abacus AI, and I'm not really sure how are they fitting in all the features with just 10 bucks per month. It's not that they only have access to all the most popular LLMs nowadays, but also they have a connection to other applications. Here you can see Slack, Google Drive, Confluence, Teams, so you can basically create your own bot which has context about everything. There is also a GitHub connection tool where you can connect to your GitHub and then you can ask anything you like about your repo. So here we can choose, for example, the app directory and package.json and add those 46 files into context. And we could ask like, could you give me tips? What should I refactor? And he's going to answer with those GitHub files. As we can see, he was using Claude Sonnet 3.5 and he gave actually a couple of really good tips. Create a common layout component. So this is in 8 bits project. We are repeating a lot of components and he noticed that one immediately. So he said that we need to create a reusable component page layout, which is really a good tip. Then extract demo section, create a reusable component demo component for the demo section that appears in every page. So again, it's like dry principle. He is telling us to create something dynamic so we don't repeat ourselves all the time on the project. And there are really a bunch of tips that he caught that are really good. And this is something that we could do also in other AI code editors. But thing here that is different is, for example, we can create a PowerPoint which is going to give our clients, for example, like some showcase of our application. So we can say here, create please a demo for showcasing this app. So we can choose now here our PowerPoint template. I'm going to choose modern and submit. And there it is. We have our PowerPoint presentation. Let's see how does it look. So we have here what is 8-bit CNUI? Here he didn't pick up the buttons in the right way, but we could just put in the images. Then we have key features, component showcase. So here we just need to put actual screenshots and then installation. So everything is pretty much good. Everything is coming from, from GitHub, from real code. And this needs to be reformatted a little bit, but it looks really good then demo dashboard, component library. Nice. So this is something, it's not over. It's maybe like, let's say 90% over. So we need to add screenshots of everything and just fix it up a little bit. But it's, as always with AI, a really good start. And code editor is also the same as all other AI code editors. It's also a fork of VS Code and it has a bunch of models. I'm almost always using Claude Sonnet 3.7. I was testing GPT 4.1. And if you've been following my channel, you know I'm not really a vibe coder. I'm not getting over 100 credits a month like ever with Cursor or Windsurf. So what am I using AI code editors? It's, for example, if we go to this page here and if we have, this is the perfect example, select item. I love to get auto completions for everything. So here I'm adding additional content and I don't need to type it in. And also if I have some type errors, I love to press like right click and tell me fix this error, what should I do? That's mostly for what I'm using here the chat or the agents. So if you are a vibe coder, please check the limits of this subscription. But as always, I'm not recommending you to vibe code everything and to not understand all the code. You should know what are you building and how are you building it. I hope you enjoyed this video. You have all the links in the description below. If you have any questions, just ping me in the comments.